Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be on some empties. This is my first ever empties video and I have quite a bit of products that I've stocked up over like half a year to film this and kept putting it off. So this should be exciting. Before we hop into it, please remember to hit that subscribe button. It would mean so much to me. And let's start talking about my trash. Okay, so I have these two L'Oreal Elnit hairsprays. I like these. Would I repurchase them? Possibly in the future if I run out of what I'm currently using. I do like to switch my hairsprays up. But I went through two bottles of these. I have the Extra Stronghold for color treated hair because I have color treated hair. And I have the Stronghold. We go through these quick in this household because my husband uses hairspray too. And he likes these, so maybe he'll pick them back up. The next empty that I have is Philosophy Fresh Cream 3 in 1, so the shampoo, shower gel, and bubble bath. This is my holy grail shower gel, and if I had a better tub, I would be using it for bubble bath. I am on my first jumbo, so I did repurchase this as a jumbo. Um, I used the lotion as well. So I have repurchased this. I will continue to repurchase this. I have a jumbo backup of both the lotion and the shower gel. And I also wear the fragrance. Philosophy Fresh Cream is my scent. This is the best. If you like to smell like a cookie, like a baked good at all times, then you need this in your life and yeah, used it up and I will continue to use up every one that I repurchase ever. Philosophy, please just never discontinue this. This is my favorite. Just if you want to see my favorite bath and body and fragrance stuff, then let me know and I'll make that. It's all gonna be very sweet smelling stuff because I like to smell like something I want to eat. The next product that I've used up, the next empty, is the CeraVe Hydrating Facial Cleanser. I have repurchased this. I will continue to repurchase this. I talked about it in my skincare routine, which I will leave a card for somewhere so you can click my skincare routine if you are interested in hearing more about this product and more about how I take care of my skin. Um, this stuff is great. I'm going to continue to use it for forever because it works for me. And then on that note, another CeraVe product that I mentioned in my skincare routine, the Daily Moisturizing Lotion. I love this stuff. It makes my skin so soft, so plump, so hydrated, and is it's cheap. I have repurchased. I will continue to repurchase just like the past couple of items. Love that stuff. A skincare item that, okay, there's, there's a little bit left. I don't know if you can see that. But I'm, I'm counting this as an empty. I don't like this stuff. I, this is the e.l.f. Super Tone Toner. It's, it's okay. I didn't really think it was doing anything and it made my skin kind of sting sometimes. I mean, it, it's alright. There's a tiny bit left, but I'm, I'm done with this. I'm counting it as an empty. I used as much of it as I could bear and it just wasn't clicking with my skin, so... It's an almost empty, and I will not be repurchasing that. This It Cosmetics brush bath is amazing. I spot clean my brushes after every use, and I deep clean them with something um, once a week. But this is what I spot clean with, and I've gone through like five of these. I will always repurchase this. I got turned on to this when I worked at Ulta a few years back, and... I've never turned away since. I love this stuff. The Bobbi Brown Vitamin Enriched Face Space. This thing is empty. I scraped every bit of this that I could out of this jar. And I had a backup waiting. This stuff is amazing. This is my favorite face primer. I love it. And I can't say enough good things about it. If you want to hear more about this product... Um, I'll put my base routine somewhere here for you guys to see. This stuff is great and it smells like lemons. This next one is, I don't know if you can see this, but 
this lip gloss. This is ColourPop Champagne Mommy. And I don't know if you can see it. I literally was scraping the sides of this gloss. I could not get anything else out of it, but it's empty. There's just a light coating on the edges of the tube the bottle, whatever you want to call it. This is one of my favorite lip glosses. I I just I love this thing and I'm I already have another one. It's been repurchased. Love it. I've never gone through an entire lip gloss to the point of scraping the sides like that until this gloss. I love this thing. It's one of my favorite lip products. It's one of my go-tos if I don't know what to wear. I grab it. I love this. Stuff's awesome. Okay, we'll talk about these two together. Anastasia Brow Wiz in medium brown. Couldn't twist it up if I tried. There's like a little nub. And dip brow gel. It's coated on the edges, but there's like nothing left in here. I I like these a lot. Dip brow gel is what I reach for when I'm not really filling in my brows when I'm doing like no makeup makeup. And Brow Wiz is what I use every time I fill in my brows and do my makeup. I am using one right now and I have two more backups. This is my favorite brow pencil. No other brand has a good color like this for me. The last empty that I have for you guys is the Anastasia Dewey set. I am currently on my second one. This did last me a long time though. I like this a lot. It's my glass skin essentials. So if you want to see more about this product, then click the card that I'm going to put for my glass skin essentials. I love this a lot. Will continue to repurchase until I find something else that I prefer. But I just love the way it makes my skin look. And I use it every time I do my makeup. Those are all the empties that I've had stocked up for you guys. Let me know if you enjoyed this video. Um, do people even still watch empties videos? I watch them. I think they're fun. I wouldn't have filmed one if I didn't. But yeah, I hope you enjoyed this and I'll see you guys all next time. Bye!